What short story completely mind-boggled you? Part 2. Coffins used to be built with holes in them, attached to six feet of copper tubing and a bell. The tubing would allow air for victims buried under the mistaken impression they were dead. Harold, the Oakdale gravedigger, upon hearing a bell, went to go see if it was children pretending to be spirits. Sometimes it was also the wind. This time it wasn't either. A voice from below begged, pleaded to be unburied. You Sarah O'Bannon? Yes, the voice assured. You were born on September 17, 1827? Yes. The gravestone here says you died on February 19? No I'm alive, it was a mistake. Dig me up, set me free. Sorry about this, ma'am, Harold said, stepping on the bell to silence it and plugging up the copper tube with dirt. But this is August. Whatever you is down there, you ain't alive no more and you ain't coming up. 